Welcome to our Silicon Valley vlog. This is the Mill Me team, the hungriest team in Silicon Valley. Akash started his day off improving the restaurant pictures within our app. Then we met with founder and investor Dave Payne, who was the first investor into Mill Me. We got to ask questions like this. <laughs> Through the 20 companies I've invested in, and I, and I just decided my next class, so I actually know the, the next 10 as well. I could, I could sort of talk through all 30 of those. I think Matt and Will are doing the thing that probably investors say is like the most important thing to do, which is move really fast, like cycle really fast. After that, we had another investor tell us a story. Then we had demos where we go over what we accomplished yesterday and what we're doing today. Things are going well. We've had over 200 users in our app in the last 30 minutes. Today, we even had time to get more furniture and a Nerf gun. Some members of the team started their day off with a jog by the Bay Bridge. And then right after we got into demos. Demos, we go over what we accomplished yesterday and what we're gonna accomplish today. Hi, I'm Priyush, Priyush Resta. I'm a software engineer intern out here at Miami. I'm actually from Canada, so I go to UBC up in Vancouver. You having fun? Yeah, so much fun. <laughs> Hard work, but it's, it's, it's fun. After demos, a scout for an investor came through to learn more about what we do and learn more about the team. After we gave him a tour of our place, we headed straight to WeWork. WeWork is a co-working place, and I accidentally set off the alarm. We can be very productive here and collaborate at these long tables. We were 17 floors up, so we had amazing views. On my walk back to the penthouse, I went to the Nike store. They had a dope entrance and some amazing artwork. And then I ordered my dinner for the night, thanks to Mil Me. Today we had... And what do you do here at Mil Me? I'm a software engineer. What's your major? I'm majoring in math and computer science and second major in financial engineering. What's your goals in life? Have a good family, make money, um, have fun. We had a nerf break and then an engineer from a top so tech company came like through. Working at a big tech company in San Francisco. It's pretty difficult. You're constantly, constantly just at 100%. Overall, it's, you're working on extremely interesting software. I can't complain at all. We had lunch and asked them a few more questions. They're growing tomato and lemon on the top of our roof. TikTok star Con Sanity came through shortly after the engineer left. We gave him a tour of our penthouse. He enjoyed his stay. Then we stopped by Mission Dolores Park to see some dope views and meet some dope hey, people. Download Mail Me. Download Mail Me. We balanced on the slack line and then we headed back to our penthouse to create some content. Yesterday was our chill day. We just had longer demos. To celebrate a productive week, the team took a train trip to Palo Alto. They had a chance to freshen up and explore. Use Mil Me, don't get in line. <laughs> and today we picked up a new team member. So what's your name? My name is Ben Svoboda. And where are you from? Uh, I'm from Ashburn, Virginia, Nova. Okay, what school do you go to? I go to uh, University of Illinois in uh, Urbana-Champaign. Okay, what do you study there? I'm studying uh, computer science. What's your favorite food? I'd have to go with some baby back ribs. Baby back ribs, yeah. okay. Yeah. We had a meeting with the founder of Decentraland's new game, Big Time Studios. After that, we headed to the tallest building in town to work on creating the ultimate food app. The vibes were immaculate, and we were able to get important tasks complete while looking over the entire city. Mondays are dedicated strictly to the grind. So that is all today from the hungriest team. Edition. <laughs> today we have... Varun. And what's your major, Varun? Uh, I'm studying computer science. All right, how old are you? I'm 19. So what are you working on for Milmi right now? Right now, I'm working on adding groceries and getting all new services to work. What college do you go to? I go to Purdue University. After completing some of our tasks for the day, we hit the gym. Last week, we added Milmi Cash. Now you can add promo codes into your wallet for orders in the future. Now you can order quicker in the Milmi app. Today, we hit an all-time high of 550 orders. We celebrated with a quick Nerf war. Valley. Today, we have... Harun. How old are you? 22. Okay, and what do you do here at Milmi? Uh, I'm a software engineer, full stack. What advice would you give somebody that wants to start an app? To just do it, just start. Thing, you know, if you don't know how to code, learn how to code. 
just have something there because uh, once you start, that's where motivation comes in and then that's where you can you know build on top of what you already have. These are the first groceries ever ordered in Milmi. We got dates, egg, and coffee. I found out pineapples can go on pizza and our stairs are also a pull-up bar. The joke is funny, people clap. If it's not, you get shot. What did the great say when he got sat on? Nothing. He just let out a little wine. <laughs> Great sounds really fresh, but not as fresh as Yasin's new haircut. I like your cut, <laughs> <laughs> Guys, don't not shoot me. My joke is excellent. <laughs> this is the Milmi team. Our goal is to solve the overpriced food delivery problem. We are a Gen Z founded startup in Silicon Valley creating the affordable food delivery app. Welcome to our daily vlog that shows how we do it. I wanted to hear from some entrepreneurs in the Bay Area, and this artist had his wire art on display, so I decided to interview him. So what's your name, man? Uh, my name's Kenneth. How long you been doing in this business? Ten years. What made you get into this business? I always been doing this as a child, you know, and all through my life, I always thought about doing something in line with video games, but I went to school for it, but I didn't like it. I didn't like the ask of building off the computer, so I started doing wire art, and I said, hey, we want to if I turn this into some kind of video game type of art. The founders met with an investor today. What's your name? Gil. What school do you go to? Texas Tech University. And what do you study there? I'm a finance major. What do you do here at Milmi? I'm an operations intern. And what's a fun fact about you, Gil? I speak three languages, Hebrew, Russian, and English. My desktop arrived in the mail today, so stay tuned for even better content coming. I used our pickup feature today because I wanted to get out of the house. I was able to take a detour to see the city while my food was being prepared. It's amazing to see how far food has developed since the pandemic. This restaurant had a window to pick up food. What's your name? I'm Akash Priyapan. Okay. And how old are you? I'm 19 years old. Okay. And what school do you go to? I go to Georgia Institute of Technology. And what do you study there? Computer science. And what do you do here at Milmi? I am a software engineer here. What have you learned here at Milmi? Uh, work ethic. Work ethic is really important and just seeing everyone else work this much makes me want to work even more and work really hard. Never ever give up. Uh, there are times when you might want to just stop working that you might want to throw the laptop on, on a wall or something like that. At the end of the day, you either do it or you die trying. Thank you guys again for allowing us to hit this huge milestone of 10,000 in a day. I think the Giants were aware that we hit a huge milestone today, so they had fireworks for us. Isn't that amazing? That was so nice of them. Let's go! Hey Alexa, play hype up music. Today we walked to Spark Social for lunch. It was a dope place that had a great setup, great food, and some awesome food trucks. We ordered ahead of time on Mill Me, so as soon as we got there, we scooped our food and then we started walking to our seat. What'd y'all get here? The original Koja. First thing I saw on the menu. <laughs> Flavors immaculate. These loaded fries were definitely bussin'. 1010 would recommend. Matt saw these when we were walking to our table, so he couldn't pass up on them. Oh man. Gas or pass? Gas. Gas. After we finished eating, we started doing some in-person reach out and got some people to download Mill Me. I met up with Elvin, who reached out to us on Instagram. He's an SF native. Yo, shout out to Mio Me, <laughs> hungriest team in Silicon Valley. Sunday, we have our longer demos where we go over what we accomplished for the entire week. After Sunday demos, we get to have the day to ourselves. We went to the park to shoot some hoops and have some fun. What we've been working on groceries in Mill Me. Yes, you heard that right. You can order groceries in Mill Me in the near future. Here's a quick demo of what you can get. Dairy, eggs, prepared food, vitamins, supplements. And here we're showing the aisles within the grocery store. We selected the candy and it's showing every single candy bar within that grocery store and the price right beside it. This is huge, but we're not stopping here. Chefs are next in Milmi and a web version is coming soon. What's your name? My name is Derek Luan. And how old are you? I'm 19. Okay, what school do you go to? I go to UC Berkeley. And what do you study there? Study CS. Okay, what do you do here at Milmi? I'm a software intern, so I'm mainly working on full stack, front end and back end of the customer service website. Okay, and what have you learned here at Milmi? I learned a lot, everything from like solving problems to new APIs, like Gmail API, just like a ton of new products and tools. Do you think you've been more productive because you can order food? Of course. Before dinner, we got a quick pump in, and then the team went out to this nice Mexican restaurant where we ate mad swell. Stay tuned to see what we do tomorrow. 
Today started off with a morning walk to see the beautiful views that San Fran offers. Then shortly after, we started work and I had the chance to work at this beautiful place with this rooftop view. Do you think food delivery makes your life more productive? Absolutely. Absolutely. I don't gotta think about cooking food, preparing for it or anything like that. I just go on the MealMe app and then order me some food. When I'm working, I can just quickly order food on MealMe. I know I'm getting the cheapest and fastest deal. Save me tons of time. For dinner, we went to Spark Social again. We're quickly becoming regulars here. What's your name? Yasin. Hey, how old are you, Yasin? 23. I'm the CTO. CTO? Yes, sir. And how are you liking being CTO for Milmi? I mean, it's great. I meet a bunch of, manage a bunch of great guys, a bunch of smart people, the best of the best. Learn a lot of great stuff. You know, teach a lot of the uh, interns how to do stuff. Teach the uh, full-timers how to do stuff. It's what has been your best experience at Milmi thus far? Best every day. Every day is amazing. I'm like, I like how everyone just pushes themselves to the, to the very extreme. This every day is amazing and every day is memorable. So I love it. After another successful day, it ended off with a beautiful sunset. Started off today with demos per usual. We even included the virtual squad. After cleaning up a bit, I went to this dumpling place near our penthouse. I placed my order directly in Milmi. Afterwards, I met with a Google employee while the founders were meeting with an investor. Today, I created some merch designs for Milmi. Stay tuned to know when these drop. Before you know it, it was time for dinner. Matt, what you chefing up here? I'm making some polenta with baked chicken drumsticks and vegetable medley. So today we have... I'm Matt. I'm the co-founder and president of Mealme. How old are you? I'm 23 years old. And what school did you study at? I went to Emory University. What was the first thought of Mealme? Mealme started out as a social networking app for food where you could post your food pictures, see a food picture that one of your friends posted, and click on it in order to your house. How committed are you to Mealme? Discommitted. <laughs> What's your favorite experience at Milmi thus far? Or actually was hitting 10k in sales. That was a really fun night. And what are you looking forward to with Milmi? I'm looking forward to Milmi being the number one food app on the App Store. Today we had our founder story of the week, which is the co-founder of Five Stars. Five Stars is worth tens of millions, so he dropped a few gems for us. I stopped by the Warriors June 10th celebration, and then I interviewed a DoorDash driver. I was asking, how much do you like DoorDashing? Sometimes the okay. I stopped by Beta, which displays early stage innovative products. They had a product that could translate any language in real time. It could even translate signs with the photo translator. When I got back to the Milmi house, we ordered the pizza to Times Square and we gave it to a random civilian that found the pizza first. Then the marketing squad went to a Giants game. Matt enjoyed himself a sausage, and we had a great time talking to people at the game. We even got a few people to download the app while we were watching the game. We got hungry mid-game, so we decided to order some food to the stadium. They didn't let us back in, but it was all good. It was getting cold. With gyms, celebration, and our progress. Enjoy. At 12, we celebrated Haroon's birthday. He's turning 23. We got him some chocolate cake, and don't worry, he got his payback on Ben. Shortly after, one of our investors flew in to meet the team. The morning after, we all lifted together. And then we had daily demos where we showed off the new updates within the app. And also, Henry introduced himself to the team. What's your favorite thing about working in a VC fund? My favorite thing about working in a VC fund is I get to meet guys like Milmi. Milmi is the fastest growing company in our portfolio. We have 90 companies, and they're the fastest growing company by far. Oh, wow. That's, that's great to hear. What's your favorite thing about Milmi? The thing about Milmi, I would got to say the founders and the team, it's a really young, hungry team in Silicon Valley. <laughs> They're making it easy for anyone to get cheap meals fast, find the best selection, the widest selection. I think it's really going to be a game changer. It's a 12 trillion industry and, and uh, if they take 10% of it, that's going to be a really big outcome for them. Varun ate the hottest pepper we could find. We had a motivational speech by the full timers. Not here to build a food app. We're here to prove a principle. It's that principle he's hitting on, that Matt's hitting on, that I'm hitting on. That if you work hard enough, you can achieve anything. Yeah. On Sundays, we have our weekly demos where we go over what we accomplished for the week. This is Akash explaining the bugs he squashed, and here's a graphic displaying the number of orders we get per zip code. We go over cool stuff like this and more so we can further optimize the app for our users. After our meeting, we headed to Pacifica Bay to try the Taco Bell on the beach and finish the week off strong with some team bonding. 
I believe we're the hungriest team because even at the beach, we never stop networking. Every download counts. Today started off with some coffee pickup in Milmi. Pickup is a superpower if you know how to use it right. I started editing a video for the event we're having on Sunday. If you're in the Bay Area, pull up. Meet KiwiBot. This is one of the ways Milmi can deliver your meals. It uses LiDAR, which is one of the most advanced sensors in the world, to do that last mile delivery for our users. The team ordered delivery for dinner tonight. It was a 10 out of 10 experience. Look how delicious that pasta looks our days off with meetings in person and virtual we are all working towards creating the ultimate food app we had some locals come through to check out the mill me penthouse like jj and shaq we gave them a tour and told them about our story we have created the rare mill me 3d logo that projects as a hologram we believe this is the future of marketing we have been preparing all week for the meet and feast event at mission dolores park come through if you're hungry I got some hot dogs from some street chefs. If you've ever been to a Giants game, you know exactly where I got these from. We picked up 20 large pizzas for our event, which was on Sunday. We had an amazing turnout. We got to meet a lot of our users, we played games, and we gave out 160 slices of pizza. Matt showed off his Mill Me tattoo and got praise from the audience. And as we ended off another great week, we got to see fireworks from Oracle Park. 